It can't possibly... I, I, I think I needed to wait a bit more before knocking him out. I, I think, like, he basically caught me knocking him out. It's pretty bad. If I got the bounty, like, immediately... As I was knocking him out, I would just reload and... Uh, and just keep the run like that. There's only, like, I don't know, 20 seconds. Well, maybe 30 seconds more like, but... Um, like, whatever. <laughs> but, but that was, like... I already wasted, like, a minute, and then I would have had to reload. Just have to restart that. But if it goes wrong again, uh, then I'll actually just reload and keep it run. Maybe I should make a safety save there. But since now I have those available, I can make some safety saves. Okay, I'm gonna talk to one AI first again. Because I think it's maybe slightly better to do so. Hello Mario, thank you for the good luck. Of some weird XP grinding. Okay, that was pretty good. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Good. Good. Now you're getting it. Good. What? Nice. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. All right. All right. Good. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off cloud of sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. All right. Good. Once again. Not bad. Again. All right. That's enough. I think this should be a much better college than the last time. Ah, I should have hold skipped that. That was a mistake. Okay, mine's zero. Let's have four scarlet. I don't know. Maybe it'll happen one day.
Maybe if we could um, somehow manip Kunish into like somewhere closer to Vaniac, so we could go to Vaniac first. And then do the Kunish, the charcoal, the beer while he's walking there. Well, I don't know how we'd get Kunish anywhere away from his house. Bounced off of the ground. <laughs> it does humans. Uh, Lord Cake, hello. What's up? Hope you're doing well. And just grind it out until it happens. Yeah. Damn it, not this way. Where the hell have I gone now? Through this, okay. That's a little different than usual. Damn it, not this way. We've got our experiment a little better. I'm gonna keep trying this uh, weird. Shit, this is the wrong way. Weird, weird new route ideas. Oh, I think it was something like this um, <laughs> that I had in mind once. Okay, this is really weird now. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Okay, that, that was... That, <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna do that again. I don't think it was too slow. But... <laughs> I was so close to dying. Forgot to hit sleep. The sleep button. Oh, sick. The door is open. Listen up. I think it's like... Um, if you reset after you have gone through there once... I think the... I think that's how you get the open door. Similar to how corners tend to be in a different position if you reset. I think the game just doesn't like... Like, some stuff sort of remains in the memory even if you start a new game. Somehow I got my horse really far. And also I forgot to hold skip that cutscene. Where did I take damage? 
Was it because the guard punched me? Also, I think no guard here. Oh, that's cutting it a little. Oh, that was too close. Too close, okay. Last time we was a bit more to the side. Okay, hey, whatever. Plus two. I'll take it. What's that? What's that? What's, What's that? that? Gone with the knees. <laughs> Anyone in chat gone away with the knees? What was that? An accent. Okay, I got the same stamina management again, although I have a little bit less HP. I think this is going to be nice stamina management. Hopefully this is enough. Okay, just enough. Be better to kill that guy though. Like, that's right. Turn tail and run, you bastard. Yeah, is there you, Henry? No. Uh, like, if you have to waste a few seconds just waiting for him, like you can pretty much kill him in a few seconds and get more experience. Maybe even a little bit of money. Uh, or from some loot. This is a good place. You're gonna like it. Okay, <laughs> yeah, it's made of paper. Or maybe our sword is just so good. I'll slay you. God, come on, slay me! 
Slay me already! No! Slay me! Yeah! 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 I need to stab him. Ah! Oh. Ah! He wasted like 20 seconds of my life. Just now. This <laughs> future tense. I will slay you. Like he, he was just constantly walking towards me to do the clinch, which which doesn't deal any damage to me. It's so annoying. I can I should have stabbed him when he was approaching me too much. The reason you need to be faster than that. Okay, hold on. Let me make my chat a little bit bigger. Just got clinch master and wanted to clinch. Yeah, understandable. Okay, he's not here yet. I'll eat first. Alright, this should work better than the last time. I hope. Okay, there he is. Very good. Very good positioning. It just appeared right in front of me. That was fast. Horse? Horse, horse? Pretty fast menu in there. <sighs> okay, no encounter there. <laughs> the, 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 there can be an obstacle or ambush or something in that crossroad so often it's annoying. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so I'm gonna try not doing the fast travel here to the gate. I don't think it's really worth it anymore. So we did the fast travel later. Oh, that was the best. That's nice. 
It makes sense. Ah! I missed the oars. Nobody saw me stealing. He just doesn't do anything. But at least I get some experience. I don't want to like be low on strength on the human fight again. But also that I don't think that's really worth it. Too bad. You're not a complete dead loss. Ah, what's the case? Hello. I decided to stop by this time. <laughs> Welcome. Going to volleyball? Okay. Um, have a nice volleyball. Let's see you later. Try it. You strike a few times at the side where I'm not holding my sword. Good. 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 Well done. There well done. Go. Good. <laughs> right. Lesson two. Everything you've learned about blocking. Very good. Long. When I cover, I can simply fend off your blows with my sword and gain control of the space between us. It's better not to control just the space, but actually your opponent's weapon. Attack, and I'll show you. Ah! <laughs> All right, that will do. Now you. The trick is to stay in your stand. As soon as I start to attack, you block. The move knocks the blade aside. Get in the corner. Very good. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, that's it. Nice. Well done. Nice. Right, now we'll try it a little faster. Concentrate and block just at the moment I start attacking. I'll strike you from above each time so you can see it well. Oh, I got, I got baited there. Well done. Ow. Okay, hopefully both of those counted. Ow. Good. Good. Okay, okay, he didn't give me the failure dialogue. Good, good. Now let's try Okay, that, that wasn't too bad. That was decent training. Whew, okay. Let's go.
Captain Bernard. Oh. Wait a while, Henry. Okay, okay, that's good. Very nice. Oh, by the way, I hope the stream quality looks good because I did some adjustments. Um, the the like game footage should have better scaling now. But I dropped the bitrate, and I, I think like I think those two should. Or like the better scaling should compensate for the lower bitrate, I think. Take your eyes off your opponent. You'll see a strike before it's even properly started. All right. All right. Not bad. What? <laughs> what is that about? Well done. It, it counted. And the last I didn't even dodge, and it counted somehow. Trick. You raise okay. The sword, sure. Force your opponent to block. <laughs> okay. The attack at the last moment, and the opponent won't even know what hit him. Try I'm okay with the weapon, then change the attack zone and strike, so I don't have time to react. <sighs> no, again. How did he do that? Good. Very good. <sighs> well done. <sighs> no, not <sighs> like that. Nice. How did he? How did he block no, those? That's not it. <sighs> good. <sighs> <laughs> that was cheating. <laughs> Very hard. Come on. Oh, hello, um, Alois. Nice speedrun, thank you. <laughs> how, how can you see the experience on the screen? Uh, you need to have dash dev mode as a launch parameter. And then... Hello. I can show you in a moment. It's a console command. I decided to allow it for the speedruns. Because it's a nice visualization, so that like viewers will understand more what's going on. When I'm just like, I don't know, jumping against the wall or something. Um. <sighs> Is that gonna work? Did I overshoot the horse? Now concentrate. A bow ain't exactly the weapon of choice of a knight, but it can come in very handy. You've got two bandits coming at you from a distance. You shoot one come on, come on, come on, you can do it, or no. Ah, oh, no, wrong save. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. I mean, there's going to eventually be some downtime. I can show you then. Okay, that was better. Okay, too bad I failed the first time. Now concentrate. Oh, ain't exactly this is fine. The choice of a night, but not a big deal. May the Lord watch over you. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, as there might be some new people here on stream, so what I do here is um, I do that trickery so that the horse will push me towards Bernard, and he has this glitch dialogue that will give us infinite bomb races, which we can sell for money. I mean, infinite um, constrained by the amount of time that the archery training lasts when it when it ends. Then I, of course, can't get any more. 
one braces, but um, we will get enough during this time. And since there isn't really a way to speed up the training anyway, um, this is really a good way to earn money. I'll be with you. Take care now. Our show of fire cursor. I actually decided to not allow that console command for the speedruns, since um, it's kind of like a cheat, in a sense. It's like you're not supposed to have it there. It makes the game easier than it's intended to be. And then also that's the kind of thing that somebody watching this speedrun might think like, like, hey, yeah, that's not supposed to be there. Like the, that's like that's cheating. Uh, it's, it's not good if uh, viewers get that kind of impression. Good luck to you. I'll be with you. But of course, uh, some monitors, for example, have these um, crosshair overlays that you can use. The Lord watch over you. And stuff like that. Uh, <laughs> of course, the rules wouldn't be able to prevent uh, such use cases. But if somebody wants to do that, then um, go ahead. <laughs> but... I personally like to run this game yeah, well. without any archery cursors. I feel like that's how it's intended to be. Here's another nice trick. Nice. So we drop so many freaking bows that they just push us out of the contest area and it just immediately ends the contest. And here I just drain my stamina so that um, Hans can kill me faster. Oh, we need him to cooperate. Okay, that wasn't terrible. Oh. I miss aimed that a little bit. Okay, I'm definitely losing a little time on this blade, unfortunately. Cannot be helped. I messed up the horse trick. That's not a big deal. It certainly does not prevent me from um, getting a PB. This is how I talk to the bailiff of the um, town. Very reasonable. Yeah. Okay. Why is Nightingale here? No! <laughs> it's slightly further away. Now I have to wait for him to walk. I mean, it's pretty much the same. Barely makes any difference, but you know. Not only is the house of God, but as the crypt of the Lords of Lipa, our master. A bite to eat. The grave digger lives right round the corner. The priest, too. Our parish priest. A man shouldn't speak ill about serving for the Lord. This is our last. 
Yeah, you're gonna pick up um, 26 one braces. Uh, buy this. Sell these. Accept. You don't want to see the inside, not even as a guard. Naturally, we have an execution or two, but he doesn't. Okay, 1k money earned and a nice shirt. You know. He lives by Gallows Hill, the other side of the creek. This pillory was brand new in autumn, and two people have already been rotting on it. The swordsmith lives here. Red, spade, fork, and axes. All you need to tame Mother Nature. What the hell is going on? make no trouble for you. Go and check it out. You won't go to the church. Damn it, I'm hungry. That nearly ended in bloodshed. May the Lord you have to learn to handle these things, Henry. Ah, not in game, what are you doing? Get over there already. Your old neighbors are living here now. And now our people aren't too happy with him. Some fools are even calling for Sahanush to finally hand the fiefdom over to the young lord, Sahans Capon. So, yeah. so we want to sell some one braces to the armor because he gives us good money. And we have to do it now. Now that he's done with the... Ow, I need to take them out. Now he's done with his arguments with the beggar. I think it would be better to have exactly 50 one braces, but uh, it's a little rough to count to 50 like that. <laughs> when instead I could just keep mashing. And I know I get to like 52 if I just keep mashing. Maybe I should just at one point slightly pause the mashing and then continue. Maybe that will result in 50. This square here, it looks much better during the market. Then it's filled to bursting with smoke all around. Also got the baker's shop here, and that mad merchant Wolfram Prude. Prude has a pretty daughter, but he keeps her on a short reign, which the young bucks are none too happy about. I heard he even keeps the poor lass locked up at home all day. There's one alehouse here on the market. May the Lord watch over the trader's tavern. The other's up by the gate. We'll be going there later. Nice experience so far. Take care now.
little long segment during which I don't really have anything too useful to do. We used to get a bow during this section, but we don't really need it anymore, so... I don't know. I guess I'll just jump around. Okay, nice XP from running into walls. Yeah, exactly. That is exactly what's going on. You know, I wonder, I feel like maybe we should just buy some dry food from um, the innkeeper right there. The Rate fiefdom is pretty big. Naturally, it starts here by the town and continues along the South Al River. All the way Might save some trouble later. Lots of farmhouses scattered around. Neuhof, Merhoyed, Master Smill is in charge of Sahanush's stables. He's by far his best vassal. It's all a bit complicated for a newcomer, I suppose. This lord here, that lord there, this exemption here, that right there. Exemptions from exemptions, rights to half of something, so on. It could take you a year to make head or tail of it. This tower was only half the size when I was a young lad. Sir Hanush had it extended and made into an armory. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try the new trick um, that I may have come up with. To skip the dialogue with the guard at the gate. I'm thinking of riding into him with a horse instead. I think that m might give longer dialogue. Like, like oh, I learned how to ride the or ride a horse, yeah, you idiot, or something like that. I think that's that's what you get if you ride into him with a horse. Yeah, Ow! What were you going, you yeah, yeah, just like that. It's so much easier. I'll try this, um, out of curiosity, like, I don't think that's gonna work, like, I, I think the only way to skip this is, uh, punch the guy. But yeah, that should be a much easier way to skip the dialogue at the gate. No! I accidentally moved the horseshoe back into my personal inventory. Not what I wanted to do. Horse bump, <laughs> yeah. Like if you just run into him, he might just go like, hmm. And it's really hard to skip the dialogue with that. But if, if you get a long dialogue, like... Yeah. You know, oh gosh, dang it. <laughs> How did that happen? You get a long dialogue, like I got there, like, what's where you're going, you loud or something like that? It's even longer than that. It's so easy. There's so much easier. You only know how to lose the humans before palm work. Oh, God, I was watching chat. Come on, game. Come on. I can't just lose 10 seconds because I'm looking at chat. <laughs> That's so annoying. Why did that happen? Why does it have to be like this? And again, <laughs> once again, oh, torch out. Because <laughs> was like three times falling off the horse, that was a little rough.
But it's only plus 54. Not a big deal at all. <laughs> ah, take care now. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, why did I wait an hour? <laughs> Crap, that's not enough. Uh, so now I'm going to drain my energy to about zero. And then we fast travel. Uh, stop! Stop! Uh, I went too far. I can't believe it. How did I go that far? I really need to just wait more during that segment. Like, I keep overshooting Neuhoff. I mean, usually I've at least gone on the waypoint, like, I've been on the very edge. But, like, it's better to get the waypoint around like before Neuhoff rather than after because now it's going to be harder to time the in oh no I'm going to make a save here because this is dangerous. I'll slaughter you. I'll, I'll fucking kill you. This is really bad. Ah, uh, why? I waited pretty much an hour and I still overshoot it. Can't believe this. So annoying. This is entirely my fault and I'm losing like over a minute because of it. I still haven't passed out either. Like, I, I keep waiting longer and longer and it just changes nothing. <laughs> like, I, I'm about to wait like two hours and I bet that doesn't even make me pass out. Oh no, I did the mistake of going into the bushes. The little trees. <laughs> Making all the mistakes. Okay, wine and bacon skip. Okay, at least we survived. <laughs> I just want to keep the run alive. Like I don't, I don't need everything to go perfect. That's not what I'm here for. Oh wait, I didn't wait long enough. Crap! I'm making so many mistakes. Just a crazy amount of individual mistakes. To eat something. My insides are shriveled up with the hunger.
Okay, Han should be ready by this point. Okay, there he is. If this fight goes well, then uh, it's not going to be too bad. Could have gone better. Okay, good. I I'm still able to shoot, fortunately. Why do you get so close to me? <laughs> that was a little weird. Okay, could have been worse. Could have been worse. Not perfect. But we'll take it. Okay, I'm not even losing too much time. I think in my PB, that segment wasn't perfect either. Wait, I think in my PB is actually really good. Now, how am I not losing more time? I'm a little surprised. We don't know much about what happened. Okay, okay, got the energy, got the nourishment. Um, I've used two of my saves. Yeah. I'll use the last one for some like fast travel segment. Mitigate bad RNG. Get up. We gotta go before those villagers come snooping. Come on. I got so close there. Fortunately he didn't spot me yet. Well I never. The pig turns up willingly for the Good. Oh, come on, die already. No, it's not allowed to use the bow cursor. Okay, wait three times after that, this dialogue is done. Let me actually... I think it's better it's fashionable here without the oars and take the oars later. Yeah. I think that's a minor optimization. I'll let go of the shift. I feel like I'm just so sloppy today. Why is my horse flying so much? Yeah. It's 
stay on the ground. <laughs> I went to... How did I go past it that much? I'm so confused. Wow. Another sloppy mistake. <laughs> how do I keep doing this? Okay, now I encountered there, that's good. I actually got a best split there, that's interesting. Yeah. How did I do that? Good luck to you. Hey Zora, are you here? Where's Sora? Okay, here. No! I can't do it! Groom's Bridal, just buy it. <laughs> I'm just so sloppy. Whatever I'm trying to do, I'm just so sloppy today. Oh, I just can't. <laughs> I just can't do it. Yeah. Wait, I didn't even... I need to go to Tomberg. <laughs> like, this is what I'm talking about. Like, what's going on here? Yeah, it never ends. I'm just gonna keep doing this weird stuff. Okay, overshot is probably a little, but that wasn't too bad. Definitely got to this bathhouse in style. Ever enter a bathhouse like that? for the purpose of going fast. No! <laughs> okay, that's a little weird. What do we got over the stream? Almost drank the wrong potion, that would have been bad. A little bit of new movement there. Cool tech. Good luck to you. Plus 4.9 at this point. Wow. We have almost caught up. That's very good. <sighs> okay. Good. <laughs> Avoided that one.
Nice, nice, nice. Not too many encounters today. Okay, I'm gonna... It's a bit of an improved route. Um, compared to what I did before. Hopefully I can pull it off well enough. Oh, got a little bit messy, but okay. We did it. And no encounters. That's very good. Okay, we're yeah. we're actually ahead. Now. Good, good. Let's see if we can keep it that way. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not entirely. But that's fine. Oh, I think there was like an encounter there that I just barely avoided. Okay. Okay, this horse riding was really nice. We found the way without any issues. However, then I got an encounter. Oh, that's a dog. Okay, I'll just have to pray that my horse will get me out of this. Ouch. Ouch. Can't see. Where's my horse? Horsey, horsey! Horsey, you can do it! Can't see! Horse! Do it, horse! I can't see! Get this from my horse. I think I need to run. Ah, but then we have the dog. I think I'm done for. Where's my horse? Okay, I need to reload. Very, 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 very unfortunate. Extremely unlucky. Like, that just sucks. Incredibly much. Can't fast forward right now. Did I accidentally jump? Why am I falling? Um, what patch did they add the dogs? I wish they didn't. Like dogs just basically mean that you can't outrun them, which is normally a safe way to get out of encounters. You just keep running. Maybe, like, do a little bit of zigzag around some obstacles and stuff like that. That's how you, you can get away from humans, but dogs, they will outrun you. 
You cannot escape. There's no escape. It's not possible. So you just have to use your horse and hope for the best. Just hope. And usually... I mean, it would work if I could see something. But dark combined with um, losing stamina, I can't see a thing. Absolutely nothing. I can't see where my horse is, even though my horse is one meter away from me. And here we go again. Except this time my horse is better. Why is this game like this? I had such good encounter luck until now. Then I suddenly had the worst luck imaginable. Maybe that's where I should use the tape, like before the fast travel. Maybe that's a good place to use the tape. Because it does lose you a lot of time. And it's... Uh, I don't think I've had that happen yeah. before. Where I get a dog there. Like that's the worst thing that I can imagine out of an encounter. I mean, another one is the, um, another one is traveling from South South to Vronik. But there you actually have a save not too far off from there. So you don't lose as much. It would take a while to get across and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. Come on. This is still much better than last run, but... <laughs> just when I got ahead of my PB, this starts happening. It's just I'm so unfortunate. But I can still definitely PB. I was only plus one last split. I'm probably gonna be a little bit further away after this one, but I have plenty of time save coming up. <laughs> a bad charm bring encounters? I don't think so. Like, <laughs> I, I, I think the game just the game just gives me encounters whenever it wants. Nothing to do with any viewers that I may have. Be with you. Oh, also, Alois, if you're still here, um, uh, was it? Now, okay, now I remember, it is WHUI game event log level 3. That's what it was. Hey. Oh. May the Lord watch. 
Okay, a bit over one minute behind here. I kind of wish I just reloaded that dog encounter immediately. Like, I've gotten away from dogs before. So I was thinking I can do it again, but not this time. It's just too chaotic from the south and storm them over the in that forest at night. Okay, now just got one of them. Oh, he moved slightly because of the corpse, that's annoying. Ah! That didn't kill somehow? Ah, oh, less experience for me. Too bad. <laughs> that ally just walked right in my way. Pass hunting to David. Minute to find him. I've noticed that he's like always there upstairs praying. At that time, I got, I just know where to expect him. Not another snap. I've definitely spent spent a lot of time before, like just looking for him. But currently, I just know pretty much exactly where he's gonna be because I'm always there at the same time. Oh. Be nice to get a kill there. Um, I'm just gonna stay back and loot because I have this theory that the game might crash if I go too much forward. So I'll just stay back and loot corpses. So far I haven't crashed when I've done that. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep doing that. Whatever I can do to make sure that the game doesn't crash, I'll take it. Forward! I feel like the loading was faster than last time. I keep missing that. No! You bastard! Get me out of here. Nice, nice, nice job. Got a little bit scary about it, recovered. Okay, now just a bunch of wounding arrows. My free equipped out wounding arrows. Yeah, I don't really need the long distance arrows. Where are the other archers? I want to get the better piercing arrows. If I can find them at all. Oh, here's the quality arrows, okay. I'll take them. I 
Okay, fine. Can I find the better piercing arrows? Or better wounding arrows? I don't know which... Which one it was. Go, go, go! Not another step! Kill them! Glory! Glory! Hey, okay, nice. Get a kill. Ahead of time like that. Why did I even hit? Oh, come on! Where are you guys going? Oh, I got the kill? That's sick. What? I'm scared now. What? the menu like that. Okay, I have enough money. I do not need to. I'll loot any stuff to sell. <laughs> Got ticket for tries to actually not die before the run fight. Yeah, it can be rough. Five tries for run. Yeah, Razzik is a tough guy. Why is it taking those guys so long? Sir! There's more of them coming from below! What the hell? To your post! Defend this fucking hill! Get ready to defend! No, not the woodcutter's axe. Oh, oh. oh I don't like this positioning. <laughs> Okay, got some more kills. Oh, Henry hit him! Oh, another kill, that's good. Um. Oh, I can't give stuff to the corpse. I wanted to give him the axe to get it out of my inventory without like having to pause the game by opening inventory like in self. Good. Two shots. Not the fastest, but I'll definitely take it. <laughs> Cadenon's mug. Cadenon's <laughs> pog. <laughs> I guess you have the um, channel points the, and the blocks. Uh, 
I'm gonna like wait. Oh, you, you can't actually dash over from here. Okay, interesting. I haven't tested that for quite a bit, but I know that like on the bridges where Radzig is, like around here, from those bridges you can actually fast travel. I didn't realize that, or like I forgot about that. Oh, this guy decided to waste two seconds of my life. Wait, what's the woman doing here? Why is she here and not inside? I'm scared. Okay, there she is. I was scared that I was going to have some problems because of that. Hey, Keep looping, loot, looting some like extra stuff there. Yeah. I just think it's fine. It shouldn't matter. Plague Doctor. <laughs> Yeah, Henry the Plague Doctor is here. I'm here to rescue your village. And uh, nope, nope. I'm just here to murder and steal. Uh, in order to progress my own quests. What am I stuck on? <laughs> Okay, Ratzik is here. Okay, we picked the right dialogue. That has never gone better than that. <laughs> or in other words, that definitely went better than PB. Yeah. Trying to end murder two people, steal their stuff. That's what we do. Yeah, we got some good sleep here. Uh, actually, I don't think there are any encounters here, so I should fast travel without the horse. Yeah. Should be slightly more optimal. Potion, Highborn, Balanced Diet, why not? What? Someone managed to punch me or something. But that's fine. I did lose a bit of stamina, which made that run slower. Yeah. 
So I think I'm going to use one of my, or like my last remaining save. Uh, before I flash all of from here, because I know there's some nasty encounters you can get there. And if you actually have to reload because of such encounters, it takes you really far back, like before Yezek. The massive time loss if you have to do that. I feel like it's a good spot for a safety save. Yeah, yeah, uh, you just need to have high enough speed. Uh, so, a combination of Bard Potion and um, Highborn Perk. Highborn Perk gives you a bonus on him because he's like high class kind of guy. Mm, so where exactly is Ratic now? Is he up here? Okay, this is... He's not up here. <laughs> Dang it, Ratic! Huh? Stop wasting my time. Uh, I buy the bard potion in uh, Tolmberg bathhouse as I'm heading to use it. Don't move a finger. All right. You you might also be wondering what happened here, and it's a fair question. What happens there is, uh, <laughs> I I can shoot an arrow through the door a little bit, which scares the crap out of Yesek. And when people are scared, they can open any doors. Good luck to you. No, 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 no. I went too far. I have to reload. I need to visit the bathhouse. Please give me an encounter so I can reload. <laughs> I mean, it's... This is only losing real time, not... um. Not really load this time. Not a huge deal. Hmm. But... Would have preferred not to do that mistake. Yeah. I've already taken some damage, so I'm definitely buying a Lazarus potion as well. Armor, Aqua, Bucks Blood, Lazarus, let's go. Now we're good. So we're gonna need that armor potion to get into Bronic easy. That's why that visit is essential. All the other potions are just like extra, uh, mostly for the siege.
Okay, good. But I'm also going to be using a Lazarus potion for this fist fight. Make them easier. Well, since we visit the bathhouse anyway. there. A little awkward, but it'll be fine. So since we suck at fist fighting, uh, we bring in a polearm. Um, so let me use the letters. Okay, avoid leaving the polearm near corpses because it's hard to pick up. Maybe hard to see. Like to you, <laughs> thank you. Punch is just too good. Uh, where can you find this site? Um, at Frate. Uh, in the speedrun, we get it after we finish Awakening. So we get the horse and then we go back to Frate. Uh, and then go meet Pratic. And then before the training with Bernard, I pick up the polearm. It's like a little tower behind the church. Oh, I'm saving a lot of time here. That's interesting. Oh crap, wrong dialogue. God be with you. God be with you. <laughs> He always has a truly happy tone saying something positive. That's nice. Uh, yeah, um, you're not supposed to be able to store it in your inventory. But when you enter training with Bernard, um, with a polearm in your hand, it goes into your inventory. It's a handy glitch. Yeah. What can I say? Oh, come on, go faster. Yeah, like, there's no way we would. We would be able to do the fist fights with our fists. So I'm really glad that's possible to do. We're actually ahead. 
after everything that's happened. And I should be able to save more time here. Coming up. I need to equip the bow. Warning arrow is fine. I'll wait a little bit of time so that the monks get past. And they're not in my way. No, 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 no. Okay, this is a little bad. Okay, I don't think they caught me. I think they did not catch me. Okay, do I have... Uh, scout to available. Yes, I do. Whew. Okay, now hopefully I don't get caught by encounters. Nice, nice. This is gonna save me so much time. Uh, armor potion. We're point. Bow away. Okay, drain my stamina, get punched. Yeah, definitely well triggered potential. Easily. A record is not a very good run, to be honest. I had a lot of things go wrong in that. Oh, that guy is just sliding on his butt. Okay. Well, that seems fun enough. Need to try that myself too. Okay, I got away fast. I better get out of combat quickly. I deserve it. Nice. Very, very good. Just look at this time save coming up right here. Bam! That's a lot of time save. Have to go and see Sir Divish right away. Otherwise, they won't get to Vranjik in time. Hey! Take the orders. Yeah. Go. That's a lot of green. <laughs> Yeah, I have a multiple best splits this run to this night. I could be like eight minutes ahead at this point though. If the things actually went well.
Hello Arthur, took you 90 hours to get to the dice cast. Yeah, that's understandable, it's a, it's a big game with a lot of things to do. And I'm not doing any of it. <laughs> Except... Just what is needed to get through. I've never actually like casually played like a ton of side quests. Like I've done some of them, but I know I've only done like fifty percent of the side quests ever, maybe. He finished the game in 150 hours. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot. I mean, it was like... I think it was definitely over 30 hours for me. Again, it's not like the first time I played through it, I, I just went through as fast as possible. I also didn't bother with like all these side quests. And the DLC wasn't out at the time. Yeah, that's good improvement, right? No, what a kill steal! My experience! Why am I not hitting? Come on, Andrew. Oh, nice. Got that kill. Uh, food. Got some good food. <laughs> How did I just speedrun this if I didn't even spend 150 hours on my first run? mean okay at that time I got I was really just interested in speedrunning something but I didn't really want to like pick up a speedrun that's already been like thoroughly crowded and has a lot of runners and um, like very competitive like, I didn't feel like that was very interesting. Like, I want to take a new game and uh, try running that. So I thought this was a perfect opportunity to do that. Can I loot? Um, let me get meal. Almost got hit there. Good thing I didn't.
Okay. Use our people spear and game games they play a lot. Um I mean it's like I don't think you can truly generalize a lot. Like when do people speedrun games? I mean usually people like the games they speedrun. That much I would say. But um Should I take all the potions? Well, I mean, I don't really need them even if I didn't take them all. Again, you can also just like games a lot, um, even if you haven't played them for like hundreds of hours. Like, I, I thoroughly enjoyed the time that I played this game casually. But, like, instead of moving on to, like, 100% the game, I moved on to uh, speedrunning the game after I finished it. And that's sort of how it came to be. I'm not just doing things casually. <laughs> I mean, I, I still I play games casually a lot. I just don't stream that a lot. Like it's not that interesting to watch compared to speedrunning. <laughs> I have Kunesh as my profile picture. Yeah. Doesn't it take deep knowledge? Means you have to... After you played a lot? I mean, yeah, like, you're not wrong there. Um, but also, like, when I say I moved on to speedrunning, that doesn't mean, like, um, I just loaded up the game and tried to go as fast as possible. Just like that. I got, I started looking into glitches and um, exploits and di different kind of strategies. What are they waiting for? Um, like how I can abuse the combat. At the time, there was a glitch where you were able to grind a lot of experience really fast by like knocking out Kunesh and um, then just putting him somewhere where you were able to punch his corpse repeatedly and that just counted for like many many hits for every punch that you did I, I think it gave you like a kill on every punch like uh, on kill you get plus 15 vitality experience uh, <laughs> that's, that's kind of where I started from uh, and that's also related highly to why I have Kunesh as my profile picture on Twitch. Like, he was kind of a bigger meme <laughs> back then than he is now. You would watch casual stuff? I appreciate it. I mean, I sometimes do it, but not a lot. Yeah, of course, like, you also learn a lot by speedrunning. And then... Farewell. I've spent a lot of time just... Basically browsing and looking around, like... What are people doing? Um, that might be really useful. Like, looking into that kind of stuff. And I still do, like, every now and then, I just browse for, like, 
Kino Calm Deliverance glitches and stuff. <laughs> But there have also been cases where, um, like, someone has told me about like a um, glitch or a mechanic or something that I didn't know about. Yeah. And then I learn about it, and then yeah. I can put it to use. Um, an example coming up right here. What are you trying on here? No, wait. God be with you. I keep messing up that dialogue. Oh. Yeah, yeah, most glitches that are being reported are not useful for me at all. Uh, this right here, I did not know for the longest time for the many, many speedruns that I've done of this game, I did not know that you can just punch him and that will forcefully convince him uh, to come with you. But someone on YouTube commented like, like, hey, you can do this, like, why aren't you doing this? And then I'm like, what? You can do this? Let me try it. <laughs> and then it works just like that it used to be so much more complicated like doing a task for him like convincing his i don't know whoever that guy was i don't remember yeah. arranged for conrad to leave yeah we arranged things <laughs> really well <laughs> did that look like arrangement <laughs> to you it sure did to me. If I believed the assassin, I, I feel like I might have believed him to you. I tend to be naive like that. <laughs> oh, I learned quickly. Yeah, it, it doesn't really matter what you... What do you say, <laughs> even? In the end. Am I gonna have enough energy? I'm gonna troll with it. 49, good enough. Ah, the bacon has gone bad already. Ah, I should have eaten something. Oh well, no balance diet for me. Yeah, I've definitely dealt with him like coming to the camp there many times. How do I make the clock go so fast? Oh, 
Um, if, if you enter a longer amount of time, then it goes faster. But another thing is the faster your PC is, the faster it goes. I have a decent PC. Also, I can't attack during this section. Uh, otherwise, I would go shoot them in the face already. I can unlock the movement by that little trick, but uh, <laughs> all I can truly deal with is just run around, trying some experience. I missed. Why oh, I didn't miss there? <laughs> That's good. Good, good. Crap. No! <laughs> no, no, no. Okay. Got him. I can't hit him if you keep hitting him. Good. Oh, don't get in my way! Okay, got him. Nice. <laughs> I'm surprised that got the kill. Oh, this is looking really fast. Yeah, that was fast. <laughs> got paid to win. Yeah, but <laughs> uh, for the speedruns, we like removed that at time. We we like basically counted as a load. Because it's um, performance dependent. It was only fair. Same with Sash Howling. That was so good. <laughs> yeah, treasures of the past. Um, uh, for the speedruns, you you actually are not allowed to. Well, the, I split it into like two categories, but I always only run no DLC. Treasures of the past. Uh, I don't know if you. Is it available for sale? Um, anyway, it was really useful because you could just sell those maps. Um, that's kind of like, it feels like cheating to me. <laughs> I don't really like it. I feel like it's dumb for a speedrun. It just gets free stuff from DLC, which gives you an advantage. Like, Henry just suddenly has some maps out of nowhere. <laughs> it's a little weird. Also, the um, uh, Women's Slot DLC gives you the ability to have a dog. I don't know if it's any useful for a speedrun, but um, but for no DLC, it's not allowed, so it's not gonna have an impact.
DLC run would be so long. I mean, by DLC, I mean, like, that it's enabled. And just by being enabled, uh, it makes a difference. Like, like I described. Come on. Get And the previous law it's building. I mean, the weird thing about that is um, I know it's mostly about like getting money, you know. Um, so if you started with like a um, save game, then it's then you would just like have a save game that has like all the resources you would need and then it's kind of weird or you start from a new game and like there'd be it'd be more interesting to do that but i don't know if it would still be any good of a speedrun when it's like focused around just gathering resources you know All right, we can hit there. How does he keep countering my attacks? Come on, allies. Okay, finally the reinforcements are here. Why is it not over yet? That took so long. Oh, you gotta go? Okay, see you, see you later. Thanks for hanging out. A leveling the human master takes so long? Yeah, I don't really know much about it. I won't betray. Uh, the undead gamer traded with the party of four. Thank you very much. Uh, what were you streaming? Uh, I hope you had a good stream. And uh, everybody, welcome to this uh, speedrun that is about to get world record unless something goes horribly wrong. <laughs> I only have the final fight left. By all means, I should be able to pull this off. Are you assuming can I come too? Nice. I assume something more casual than um, speed running. <laughs> you thought it was crazy that someone was speed running? I guess so. May the Lord watch over you. I can understand why you would think that. going well then yeah it's going really well right now uh, as you can see from my timer on the top left uh, i am currently six minutes and 20 seconds ahead 
of world record. Which is my run, so I'm trying to beat my own run. But, I, you know, I want to improve it. I want to get a new PB. At the same time, a new record. Also, the timer you see there is um, that timer has loads removed, so that it would be fair for everyone. So whether you have a fast PC or a little bit slower, um, loads are going to be counted out uh, from the time. So in real time, I expect this run to be about two two twenty, uh, something along those lines. And without loads, I expect it to be less than one fifty for this particular run. If I am to beat my record. Also, you're going to see something wild uh, for the uh, siege. Oh, it isn't enough time. That that's really weird. <laughs> I didn't know he just initiates dialogue with you if you're there, just like that. That's weird. So yeah, things are about to get crazy here uh, with what I'm about to do. Um, so stay tuned on how I tackle the final fight of the main story. Currently I'm, by the way, in my underwear because I want to move fast. But for this fight I'm going to equip some armor. Finally! All game I run in my underwear, but for the final fight I finally pick up some armor, or like, equip. I already have it picked up. Hopefully I got the bow out in time. Um, okay, I'm gonna drink all the good potions. Put on the armor. I just one down. That's two down. Ah, you moved. We're like mega buffed, and the swords don't hurt us. Um, so we're gonna go ahead. Oh wow, got him too. This is going really well. So we're gonna bait these guys over here. And you get past these guys. We're gonna get them all over here. And we all go into this tight little corner and have some fun. As you can see, I'm surprisingly quite safe here um, as I'm surrounded by 10 enemies. Who would have guessed? Someone's inside me. The allies are already here. I don't know if I like that. Okay, right, this one. They're moving so rapidly. Okay, get another one down.
What, what is this action here? I've never seen this happen before. It's a little unfortunate. These guys are down there. Come on, finish him! Okay. We're done here. Moving on. Okay, they're bullying Hans here. Okay, I'm gonna try my best to help my allies. Take them out together. Much more effective. I'm not going it alone. Somehow I'm not hitting. I'm like stuck on these corpses or something. Dude, everything's in my way. I can't hit anyone. Okay, there we go. Now we're going ham. There. Okay, it ended. <laughs> yeah, that's insane. <laughs> it really is kind of insane. I'm feeling like, like this fight used to be so random and messy. It's so much better now that I discovered that. It's a really recent discovery to go into that tight spot and just truth faces. It's so good. Now we just tried, and um, the run is going to end when I hit the trigger here uh, for the cutscenes and the credits. Someone could maybe argue that the then there's the epilogue. You should finish that, but um, I mean, there's like three different points where you could consider the game ending, and I decided that this speedrun ends at credits. So it's gonna end uh, right here. Bam! <coughs> nice! The 6 minute 21 second PB slash world record. There's no Not a perfect run by any means. Had some big mistakes, some bad luck in this run. But it sure is much better than my last run.